congratulations to the real beast from the east and that is Arthur better behave he was able to stop Anthony Yard in the eighth round thanks to today Ejai. Not if not it would have been a devastating knockout after the first knockdown you could see that the legs were gone the hands were down and it was just a matter of time if Tony Ejai had not stepped in at a better be would have hurt Anthony Yard real bad Anthony Yard's chin was able to take a lot of punishment in the first seven rounds but after the seventh round you could see that his will had broken and the beast from the east was starting to give in to the to, to the mighty puncher, the most devastating puncher in boxing at a better BF. But he needs to learn it's a good it's a good learning care for him because I don't think um Joshua Boati would have given him this performance. I don't think Kalam uh Callum Smith would have given him this performance. He could hold his own against all these top guys or all these future contenders. But the level of Atta Better BF is head and shoulders above him, like I said. And if the fight had continued, Anthony Yard would have been rushed to the hospital because his will had been taken from him and he would have been receptive to the pain that Atta Better BF was about to give him. He was ready for it and it would have been devastating. Thanks to Tunde Ejai, we did not see that. That is not what we want to see. But talking of Tunde Ejai, I think it's time for Anthony Yard to change trainer or bring another trainer in camp in order for him to improve his skill so much. Now, Anthony Yard did a lot of mistakes. His head movement was very, very poor. The job of... Uh, Better be of was landing at will, and that was not good. That was one thing that was working for at a better BF. And Anthony Yard could not cut off the ring. This is what where the amateur experience comes in. He could not cut off the ring because when he was whenever he was brave enough to land punches of his own, he was able to hit at a better BF. But if he could have cut off the ring very well, made the ring smaller for Atta Better BF, he would have gained more success and we would have seen much of him or much improvement. And he was even ahead on the scorecard on two of the judges. But the game plan of Atta Better BF is not to win on the judges' scorecard. It is to break your will and take your soul. Break your will and take your soul. So, today Jai knew that and he saw that his guy was out and he did not want him his soul to be snatched away from him that is one thing boxers suffer to recover from so Tunde Eja was smart to save his his boxer from going to the dark land and that was good for uh, Tunde Eja and his boxer the hair clashes were there the referee pulled some sh sh shenanigans when the round eight he, he realized that Anthony Yard was in trouble. He was pulling up the shots of Anthony Yard, which bought Anthony Yard some few seconds. But at a better be one the one of the most focused boxers in world boxing who sticks to his game. His game plan does not care. He continued from where he left off, and Anthony Yard had no, no, no answer. The first two rounds or three rounds were quite close. You could give all to yard depending on where you are coming from and you could give some two or one two out of better bf but one thing i did not see in this fight i did not see the body shots anthony yard was also tired so imagine he has faced a fighter that was going much to the body the fight would have ended he needs to bring down his muscle mass so that he looks leaner and make the weight cleaner improve on his stamina in order to go the long distance by round four and round five he had opened his mouth big and he was breathing in air meaning that he had been exhausted so i think it's time for anthony Yard to change trainers or bring a world-class trainer to his camp Tunde Ajay has has taken him where his knowledge can take him that is too war title short he showed much improvement from the kovalev fight but it wasn't enough because who he was meeting was a better boxer at the light of way division than kovalev i think after this year it's time for um Atta better be able to also move on if he's not able to secure the 
before fight it's time for him to move on i know people are calling for the canelo fight but i think he does canelo a lot of damage because canelo sponges may not have that effect on atta beta bf but he being the smaller man he would feel the presence of atta beta bf he may be defensively sound but the the will the will would be taken away from canelo the only person i see take uh, giving atta beta bf difficulty is the wba super light heavyweight champion dimitri before because he has skills and he is disciplined and focus and very tactical so he is the only person i see giving Ata better bf problems thank you for watching i'll bring you more detailed analysis tomorrow or later in the morning so subscribe like share and comment thank you